questions every Formula One fan should know the answer to uh, with Jake and Fab. <laughs> we might not know the answer to these, but we're going to give it our best shot. You guys sent in your questions on Instagram and TikTok. Fab took the questions off Instagram. I took the questions off TikTok. I have no idea what his are. He has no idea what mine are. Let's get into the video. These are hard, by the way. Who is the tallest driver on the grid? Oh, shit. That has got to be between Esteban Ocon and George Russell, I think, are both pretty tall. I'm trying to remember that photo when we saw Daniel Ricciardo was really short. I thought yeah. Daniel Ricciardo was Ricardo tall, is but he's tiny. actually really short. I'm going to take a pot guess at that, and I'm going to go Esteban Ocon. Nope. Ah, oh, it's Russell, isn't it? It's Russell. It's fucking Russell. Do you know how tall he is? I'm going to go six foot four. And he's six foot, which is tall for an F1 oh, driver. not six foot four. Nah, six foot. Wow, so if we were F1 drivers, we'd be the tallest F1 yeah. drivers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is Maybe sick. we get into it. How many Red Bull Junior drivers are there on the grid? So how many drivers are on the grid that were part of Red Bull Junior Ooh. driving team? Okay, let me think about this. One, two, three. Three. Yeah. I'm going to give you a, a bit more of a clue here. There's seven. <sighs> okay. Who have you got so far? Verstappen. Yeah. Gasly. Yeah. Sonoda. Yeah. I'll okay. admit, there's one on there that I had no idea he was part of the Red Bull at any point. I was like, wow. Sebastian Vettel. Yep. Four. Four. Think of the driver that has currently still got a Red Bull on his hat, even though he's not a Red Bull. Alex Albon. Alex Albon. Five. Two to go. One of them drives for your favorite team. Leclerc. No. Ah, no. Fuck. <laughs> Signs, there's one more then. There's what? rumors that he may retire at the end of the season. Mm, Hamilton. No. Alonso. No. <laughs> we just said how short he is. <coughs> Ricardo. Daniel Ricardo. Seven drivers on the grid have been Red Bull Junior drivers. That's, That's fucking crazy. That's a lot. <laughs> Which team did Jensen Button win his world title with? In 2009. That's your clue. I don't think you're going to get it. Braun. You fucking... You <laughs> have been Googling. You have been Googling. Let's fucking go! That is a load Let's of Let's fucking go! That is a bollocks. That is a bollocks. How do you know that? Because I remember seeing it when we searched who won the Ferrari, and it said 2007 Raikkonen was the last winner for Ferrari. I remember seeing that 2008 and 2009. Wow. Good memory, then. It's like Braun GP in it. I would never have fucking got that. <laughs> I'm going to cut that to make it look like I'm really clever, but I actually had the same fucking question. <laughs> <laughs> and that's fucking staying in. You bastard. I'm in in this nope. video. Yep. No. Yeah. It's coming straight up. <laughs> We're two new Formula One fans. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. There'll be loads of videos coming. Give the video a thumbs up. Who has more championships? Hamilton or Red Bull? I know it's tight. Oh, it's tight. Emilia Romano I tight. I know, yeah. That's what I'm thinking. I'm going to say Hamilton. I think that... I think Red Bull's got six. I'm going to say, very, very good guess. It is Hamilton. Red Bull have five. Ah, but so, not bad at not all. Not bad. How many Canadian drivers are there on the grid in 2022? Well, Latifi is Canadian. And... Uh, Come on. I'm going through the grid slowly in my head. No, no, no. Think of the teams. Lance Stroll, maybe. He's from that side of the world. He's the only one at the moment. <laughs> they could be. It's Lance Stroll. It's Lance Stroll. It's Lance Stroll, baby. Stroll. You should have fucking got that before. I should have fucking got that. Name every teammate Lewis Hamilton has had in Formula One. For fuck's sake. Uh, Jensen Button. Nico Rosberg. I love the way you've gone for two old ones and haven't done the two recent ones. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Valtteri Bottas, George Russell. How many is there? Six. Mm, so You've done four. I'm missing two. One of them's meant to be your favourite fucking driver. Oh, oh Schumacher. Alonso. <laughs> <laughs> Alonso. I was going to say. Schumacher. Slight mishap there. Schumacher. Yeah, Alonso. Alonso. And if you get the final guy, I will do anything because there's no chance you're getting it. What do you mean anything? I can't, I can't fucking get it. Hiyaki Kovalainen. Kovalainen, I didn't know that. From 2008 wow. to 2009, he's had six teammates. How many times has William won the Constructors? What, William? 
Williams. <laughs> William. <laughs> who the fuck's William? William who? <laughs> Williams is nine. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. We're actually learning now. Which is a fucking lot. I feel like we're getting... Yeah, it's amazing. Nine is loads. It's amazing. William did well. Wait, they're second. Who has the highest record for points in a single F1 season? I know you know it because we spoke about it before. We're trying to rekindle things here. Don't know. I don't know if I do. It wasn't last season. Because I know there's been people with like over 400 points. Has there? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Right? <laughs> Lewis Hamilton. Correct! Lewis Hamilton has the most yeah. points. There yeah. she goes! What's the fastest F1 circuit? Alright, so I'm thinking to the game here. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Think about the There's game. There's that one that's like 104. I'll tell you what, give you a clue. I would have said Spa. Oh, it's the one on the and game it's not spa. that goes like that. When you come down. And you hold it around that little corner and then hold it again on that next corner and you can keep full throttle the whole way through. Nah, nope. <laughs> no, it's Monza. List every world champion from 2000 <laughs> till Fuck now. off, man. Every world champion. It's quite easy when you actually think about Nico it. Nico Rosberg, Lewis Hamilton, Max Verstappen, Sebastian Vettel, Michael Schumacher. Um, huh? From two, oh, yeah, yeah. 2000. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah don't fucking try to throw me <laughs> off. Fernando Alonso, Jensen Button. You're doing amazing. How many is there? One more. One more. Only one more. You're absolutely smashing it. Fuck. I'm not saying I have anything. to get it yeah. now. I have to get it. One more driver. Has he got it in him? Ah, uh, I don't know. I mean, I've got like either Mark Webber or David Coulthard. You'll coming, be gutted. Come, you are coming, coming you, to my head. You'll be gutted. I've got, I'm like relaying like <laughs> the image in my head from fucking all the F1 standings that we've ever looked at in the last That's six what months. I did for the Braun one. Yeah. It's one that I thought you would have got first. Really? So he must be on the grid now then. No. <laughs> but who does your nan really like? Ah, oh, Kimmy. Kimmy. The, the real wise man. <laughs> the real wise man. <laughs> Not Bottas. Once. Not Bottas. The wow. real wise man. Fuck, I should have got that. There has been eight world champions since 2000. Michael Schumacher, Fernando Alonso, Kimmy Raikkonen, Lewis Hamilton, Jensen Button, who my mum wants to date, Sebastian Vettel, Nico Rosberg, and Max Verstappen. I'm taking the W with that one. Oh yeah. I thought I did so fucking you well. You did do amazing. You can have that. This is a bit of a fun one. A bit of a tri trivial one. Come on, let's have a little bit of fun. What is Lewis Hamilton's dog called? Ah. Uh, it's tricky because he's got two. Actually, he doesn't anymore. Okay. Uh, um, so the previous one, she was. It was a girl. She was called Coco, and she passed away, unfortunately. Oh. Someone tells me it begins with an R. Someone tells me it's like Rocco or something, or like. R Rupert. Rocco. Rocky. Robert. Ronaldo. Yeah, Robert. <laughs> yeah, Robert. Yeah, I'm going to call my dog Robert. Lewis <laughs> Hamilton's turned up in the paddock with Robert. Uh, I'm going to go for Rocco. Close. It's Rosco. That is so close. It's really close. Where did Leclerc drive before Ferrari? I do know this, I think. Give you a clue. He got 39 points there. Williams. In one season. Alpine. Keep frying. Nice. Honda. Come on, think back. Citroen. It was in 2018. Reliant Robin. The year before he joined Ferrari, 2018, he raced for someone else and got 39 points. Ass. No, he wasn't at ass. <laughs> but I thought uh, being a Ferrari fan, like, you would know. That's all. I'm a fucking Ferrari fan, not a fucking whatever Leclerc does in his spare time fan. What is it? Sauber. Never fucking heard of him. Neither have I. I don't know who the fuck they are. In which country was the term Grand Prix first used for a motor race? France. Yeah, France. Correct! Winner! <laughs> ah! Name all the engine manufacturers currently on the grid. Red Bull Powertrain. Mercedes. Ferrari. And Alpine. That's it. Four. Alpine don't make their engine. No, it's Honda. They have a Honda engine. Renault. Mm. So there's four, and it's Renault with yeah. Alpine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm right. After a few guesses, yeah, but you can have it. Thank I'm, you so I'm a much. Good guy. Ferrari's most successful driver by race wins is Michael Schumacher, but who ranks second? Felipe Massa. No, not a bad oh. guess. Not a bad guess. Do you want me to tell you? No, nope. I don't know. Vettel. No, you'd think it would be. He won four world championships, but it's not even him. Who's second? It? Who's it? Rajek. <laughs> 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 Nicky Lauda with 15 wins and 32 podiums in 58 races. Wow. What are Park Ferme rules? 
One more time. <laughs> yeah, I fucking thought so. <laughs> Park Ferme rules. Mm. Park Ferme like a track or something. So like you know when we're playing the F1 game. Yeah. And like you're just about to go into qualifying yeah. for a race, and you're sat in the cockpit, yeah. and it comes up, and then on the left, yeah. sometimes it says Park Ferme rules. I've never seen that in my life. I don't know what you're on about. What do you mean? Really? I'm going to go for, like, how many DRS zones there are and track limits. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that is, like, so far away. <laughs> park Ferme rules. It means something about closed parking. When you can pit. When the pit window opens. No. It is to do with the pits. How many, pitch, how many pit stops you get? How many pit stops you have to do? Nope. How many tyres you have? Nope. Who's pitting first, you or your teammate? Nope. From the moment the car leaves the pits in Q1, Park Fermi rules means that you cannot modify your car, like any of the bodywork, like suspension, anything like that, until the end of the race day. So teams can't make alterations or adjustments to their car under Park Fermi rules. I thought that was just fucking common sense. I knew that. <laughs> yeah, Park Fermi rules. I knew that, rules. but I didn't know I had a bloody rule. Well, that's the rule. <laughs> That's the rule that so they're all under. So Park Ferme rules mean you cannot change your car. Yeah. Great. That's fucking terrible.